just want to make a quick video. It has to be quick because I got to get to work. But I'm just going to set it up on my car here. Make sure it's uh, level. I hope that's straight. What I want to talk about today is the last couple of days of my life. You know, I've been in the program for a long, long time. I take pride in that I've worked on my emotional, mental, spiritual, and physical health all the time. I really do. I try and stay in top condition in all those areas. But being human, it's really difficult at times, isn't it? But yesterday, I got into a little bit of a dispute with my sweetheart, Brenda. And I just wanted to throw the towel in. I really did. Not so much, not the towel in on the relationship, just in general. I get so sick and tired of my behavior sometimes. It's not like I go crazy and, you know, do crazy things on a regular basis. But when those character defects and those shortcomings we, you know, show their ugly head. How discouraged I get in my life. I just want to throw the towel in, quit my job, go live off the grid, you know, disappear in life and just get so fed up with it and I get so discouraged with it. It's unreal. It really is. And that's what happened to me. And that's why I'm doing this video to let you know that even after many years of being in the program, I am still not perfect. Imagine that, I'm not perfect. And I get down on myself and I start using the weapon of those character defects and showing that un that behavior that I don't like to show it. It's usually anger and hurt feelings. And I take that behavior, that, that, that occurrence in my life, and I reverse it on myself and I spend hours beating the hell out of myself. You're not good enough, Terry. Look at all the therapy you've done. Look at all the things you've done in your life and you still can't get it together. I think of those things and I get so discouraged. I really do. And I just want to share that with you. If you're in the program and you're worried about your character defects, you're not getting it right. Take it from me. It's a lifelong journey sobriety. It's a one day at a time program, but it's a lifelong journey. We are not perfect people and I am not a perfect person. I have to understand that, that I am not. And I get so sad and disappointed. The road to recovery is always under construction. When we think we have it made, when we think we have it well, going well, bang, something comes and kicks us right in the butt and brings us back down to reality and saying to ourselves, man, maybe I need to work on things again and keep my life simple. My life is a lot better than it was. But I tell you something, I get discouraged I really do. I feel like sometimes I got one day of sobriety. I really do. And I feel like throwing in the towel. Like I said, we are not perfect. Spiritual progress, not spiritual perfection. I just wanted to share this with you because I think people need to hear this, that we are not going to get it 100% all the time. We're not. For whatever reasons, we're tired, we're overwhelmed, whatever the reason is, we're not going to get it 100%. Go easy on yourself. Have some self-care, some self-love, and just say to yourself that, yeah, I didn't get it right this time, but next time, maybe I will. Okay? So God bless. Remember, sobriety is freedom. It really is. We are not as white as snow. Life is, is full of surprises, good and bad surprises. Okay? God bless. Talk to you later. Ciao for now. I got to get out of here and go to work. And it's hot like crazy in this car. And ciao for now. Bye-bye.